this is Els here at the Elizabeth Craft Design Studio introducing to you the Mason Jar Special Kit. It's another fantastic kit designed by Esther Glass. It is for your A5 planner, so for the large one. And I'm going to show you the set and I'm going to show you samples from our wonderful design team. So let's turn the camera around. So this is the set. So what comes in the set is a huge die set basically because you get the front and the back. So what you have in here, you have the page, so the planner page. And I'm going to show you how it all uh, is used uh, in the samples. Then you have a window that you can cut out. So you can use that with vellum or with as a shaker. Then you have a label that can go over the jar. You have the lid from the jar. You have a little label. Uh, this says good things. And this says wish because you can make a wish jar if you want to. Then you have a tiny jar that you can use as a label as well. And then these ones, this piece basically fits here as a decorative piece at the top of your lid. But it also makes shaker material. So the leftovers you can use for a shaker. Then we have two adorable penguins, like a solid and an overlay. Fantastic trees, of course, that, you know, just you can use them anywhere. And then some snowflakes that you can use as a shaker as well. And the dripping, and it can be snow. It can be honey, can be used in all different ways as well. So that's the die set, and it's such a great set. Then you get three, three rings with it, so you can make like your mini book. If you don't use them in the planner, that you can make a mini book. Then you have a full stamp set here, which says good things, gratitude, wish for you, uh, collect moments, memory, jar so you can make a wish jar a gratitude jar a memory jar a good things jar so you can make it into any jar love is sweet memories that makes a smile holiday sparkle uh, jam packed with love everything is better in a mason jar two decorative ornaments and this are two different stamps this says hello winter and then this is a jar that fits on the die set on that die set here then you also get an inspiration sheet and the inspiration sheet, these are all the samples from Esther that you see here. And then on the other side, and I actually have those, well, not all of them, but I have most of them here. So you get an inspiration sheet with it here. So you see a sample from Anita, Annette Green, uh, Lisanne, Anna, this is from uh, Pia, Anna Swinker. So I have those, well, I have this one, this one. So I have several samples I have here. So that's the kits. So let's go to the samples. And they are really, really, really nice, I have to say. So I'm going to put this aside. So Esther again did a great job making this die set. So first of all, you can see that you have like the, you can make it with the three rings as a mini book like this. If you turn it around, you can kind of make it into a snow globe, you see. So you can make it like in uh, this way as well. So that doesn't matter. So I'm going to show you the samples. And I also have them in the planner, so I will show that as well. And I'm not going to mention names because I don't know exactly who created everything. But I'm just going to show, I think this is uh, Anita, but I'm just going to stay away from it so I don't make mistakes. So you see here that label on the jar. Here you see the little jar combined with the florals, which I absolutely love. The penguins, uh, Anita, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's Anita, but the uh, trees are behind the vellum here. And then here a little twine around the lids. And this is the back side from that one. And uh, you see it's just, it is a fantastic set. This one, so this is a shaker. You see, so there's hearts in there and some uh, sequins. And then the wish is in there as well. So this is a wish jar. And then this says love is sweet. And then you can see the twine here, the black and white twine. Reinforcements, of course. Then... This one here, you have two different ones, one's in the green and one's in the pink. So this one actually has some really nice shaker material in there. And then this one has glitter hearts. So it says wish, jam packed with love. Here, this is a little element from the Planner Essentials as well. There's actually a little label here on the ring. It says for you. How cool is that? Absolutely love, love, love the set. This one is, um, I know this one is Lisanne, but uh, you see, so this is from Josette's collection. The little birdies are from Esther. You see here the little label again. Here I see an element, I think, from the uh, Art Journal collection. 
And here, look at that. Love this. So this is uh, the honey beer from uh, Josette. This is a label from... Um, uh, from the book, Reminiscence, the book. And it says, uh, item number, honing, honey. And a description, it's from her own garden. How cool is that? Little bee here that comes with the bear. And she, you see here, it's made into a honey dripping. And then some shaker material in here as well. Love it. Little, I don't know why she gets a little bit of flies, but a little butterfly on the nose. Some honey on the hands. Just a fantastic, fantastic sample. Then this one. So this is a, kind of just a start of a book that Esther created. But uh, you see, so she has the dripping here. This is the paper as well. Here, two little labels. I don't know if she stamped on it. Let me see. No, this is just like die cut labels, so you can write on there. And this is all from the Reminiscence, the book as well. See, and this is just to be filled in. So you can make it into a uh, like mini book, of course, with uh, pictures. Such a great, great set. You see, so that's just cut paper. And then you can make that. You know, I like my the books chunky. So uh, I'm starting mine already. And it's going to be chunky filled with fun things. Then this one. You see, that's also. So this is the one upside down, like more as a snow globe. So you can make that to shake uh, with shaker material. You see, so that's Esther created that one with some pages. Love that. Then before I go to the planners, I want to show you these because these are two cards that I absolutely love. You recognize the Under the Sea collection, of course, from Josette. Look at that little jar here. Absolutely love that. So you can make sceneries with that. So this is a kind of a bottle under the sea uh, kind of idea. Love that. And then this one, you see, that's also made into a card. So you can just make it into a card as well, like this. And basically what you do, you just make sure that you don't use the cut line here. Oh, this is actually glued. Is this glued together? Let me see. I need to see how that's put together. Oh, I think this, had, that, there's actually two. So that this one has a longer piece and it's glued underneath here. You see, and then you make it into a card. So I absolutely love that idea as well. And the penguins are behind the acetate here. And then here I have it in uh, the planners. So it's the A5 size. So this one. Uh, and of course, this can be the front of a summer book. You can see that. You see vellum with the strawberries. And it goes together with this page, you see. Absolutely love that one. Here, label here. The strawberries. Some strawberry jam. Here, a winter one. Just love it. And then a Halloween one. How cool is that? How cool is that? So you can see lots and lots of possibilities. And then I have another planner that I have some of the kind of the snow globe uh, direction. You see? Love it, love it, love it. So uh, penguins in the jar, penguins on top here. And there's actually some, um, um, there's a cut here from the snow. In the acetate, but it's because it's a stronger acetate, it doesn't cut all the way through. So you actually see kind of that as an imprint. And I know that paper in the background is from the first book. I love this. It kind of uh, feels like a metal there. Reinforcements, of course. And then here I have the back of the wish jar and then upside down. Love it, love it, love it. And then this one. Oh, this is the... Um, do I have another one in here? No, oh, because it's double. So those are the dies from last year. So that's the also from the Planner Essentials. Works great, of course, if you have that one. Here with the little holly leaves. And look at this. Oh, this is a, like a die and then a shrink foil. And then the 25th is a label uh, also from the Planner Collection. And then this one is the last one. That is the igloo with the bear. And some florals, of course. And then I have a tiny little, uh, kind of a fun little book here. No, it's, not, it's kind of a little notebook. Here, that's this one. Look at that. Because with that little jar, you can make like little labels, of course. So you can make it into fun little labels. But you can also make that into a little notebook. How cool is that? Just a super nice collection. So, or a special. So this is it. Let me show you again. So it's the Mason Jar Special Kits. So you have the inspiration sheet, two si double sided. You have the rings and you have the die double sided. 
so lots and lots of possibilities because you can and a stamp set of course but you can imagine i can use all these elements to make fantastic uh christmas or winter cards or fall cards or you know if you only use the trees there's so many possibilities uh, and you can use it on regular planner pages so that is the mason jar so that's it thank you for watching I hope you enjoy the set as much as I do. And don't forget to check out our social media. We have the ECD planners and journaling page, of course, for inspiration. And uh, don't forget to check out our YouTube channel and our Facebook lives three times a week. Thank you. Bye-bye.